ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of the Not Cooperators. We are continuing with some more Metal Gear Solid Ghost Battle. Oh, and I just shot the gun by accident. Oops. Alright, so. Um. I'm continuing with this game. I just got to the front of the fortress. And unfortunately, I can't just knock on the door and ask them to let me in. So I gotta watch out for all the, uh, set more sentry guards and, uh, surveillance cameras. And there's one over there, and then let me just take him out from the side. Punch, punch, punch. Uh, sometimes they do drop items. Hang on. Shh. They're coming. He is so slow. Speeding it up. I can speed it up. It's it's kind of funny. He left the door open for me, but let's follow where he went. Like I said, again, the music I'm hearing right now, it's actually a really good soundtrack for the Game Boy Color. Alright, let's see what happens here. It's time for the shift change. Mm -hmm. He's already. Come on, hurry up! It's like I want to sleep too. We're both in. Uh, we're both in big trouble if they catch us slacking off. Relax. Has anyone ever come in here anyway? Yeah, me. Like I said, they're very slow. I can't speed it up. But I'll try not to use it too much. And this is right, right here. This suppressor. Press it for your 5-7 uh, five, mutes the firing, so let's test it out. Ha! That's what's getting me slacking on the job, bitch! Alright, so, um, any new news for the Metal Gear Solid, uh, universe? Oh, damn it! Hang on one second, guys. Okay, now we're back. Sorry about that. All that BS and everything. Oh my god, is that a shadow? So now we're in the outside of the fortress. Uh, I gotta find a key card to, uh, to gain entry to uh, the fortress itself. Now, as I was talking about, any uh, fun, fa uh, uh, fun things that are actually happening in the Metal Gear universe? Last news that we actually heard that there's gonna be a new Metal Gear Solid game. Ooh, we're all excited about that one, aren't we? No, not really. Well, some are, some aren't. The new Metal Gear Solid game that's coming out now is by Konami, not Kojima. When it came, comes to Konami, they fuck a, up a lot of things. Like, they tried fucking up Kojima's career, and that didn't work, because Ko Kojima's career you can't kill. But they tried taking his game, which was Metal Gear Solid, which you can't really take it. Up. Apparently they did, but they're going to take it and they're going to destroy it. The new Metal Gear Solid game that's coming out, if you guys are not in the loop, is, uh... Well, obviously, for, uh, I'm sure you guys already know. But the new Metal Gear Solid game that's coming out is going to be Metal Gear Survivor, which, take note, have an, open, have an open mind right now, but take note of this. The game itself, it sounds like a good idea, but it's in the Metal Gear universe, which is not a good idea. So, here's what makes it kind of cool. The fact that you're playing as a random soldier, it takes place right after Metal Gear Solid Ground Zero, when the, uh, the base was destroyed, and you're playing as this one, uh, sp uh, one survivor, oh, okay. so much ammunition. You're playing as this one survivor that was, uh, left on the, uh, the mother base that was being, that was, uh, you know, just getting destroyed. So, as they're flying away, you're just basically, like, going, like, hey, wait for me, what about me, and then all of a sudden a wormhole, uh, happens. And, uh, that basically takes you to another, uh, takes the mother base and takes you to another, dim uh, another dimension. So it explains all the wormhole stuff that was actually happening in the other Metal Gear Solid games. But, what's going on in this game is just weird. In my opinion. Because, I, 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 I can't, like, judge what that was going on. Apparently, you're being transported, you're playing as a random soldier being transported to another dimension or world, whatever. But the fact that it's in the Metal Gear Solid universe, it just, it, 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 it really is, like, getting to us. Hold on, I got I got a call. Is anyone out there? Can anyone hear me? Who is this? Oh, thank God. This is, uh, Sergeant Chris, Gen uh, Chris Jenner of Delta Force. Delta Force? A survivor? It wasn't an, uh, it wasn't annihilated? No, who are you? The U.S. Uh, the, the the U.S. rescue team? No, I'm the black sheep. You uh, you were supposed you were supposed to work with? Question mark. Not Foxhound. Salt Snake speaking. 
You? I've heard so many things about you. What kind of th what kind of things? Well, the best Sabador ever, the one who destroyed Metal Gear in Outer Heaven seven years ago, the legend. Don't believe everything you hear. Some say I'm just uh, I'm just an attention sneaking killer. So, which is true? Make up your make up your own mind. Sergeant Jenner. Are there any other survivors from the unit besides you? Nope, everyone else is... I... They're... They're monsters, sir! They? You mean those mercenaries? Yes, especially the leader, the man called... Viper. There was nothing I can do, even if it, even if it uh, wasn't an ambush. An ambush? The mission was leaked? I don't know, but... This is absolutely classified mission. There's no way I can ever be compromised. Wanna bet? I'll get 50 bucks on that shit. There was always someone who was willing to sell out. What makes an American brass tick? Money, power, glory, women, men. Can it? <laughs> Money, power, women, men. Can it? Because I can it. There's no risk on this guy here. Pretty sure, aren't you? Everyone involved in this mission is under regular background checks. I see. They're all trusted. How, how about how about it, Colonel? This is a top secret mission. The only handful of people I know about it is the government and my mission. I know and I agree with McBride. All right, Sergeant Jenner, is Metal Gear really inside the fortress? Yes, it's still- oh my god, this shit takes way too long. Building with an exceeding east in the wall entry that- <coughs> Got it. Getting yourself back there is- is like out here is- No, I'm staying here. No. No, you're not. I have- it's like, I have no time to babysit a- 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 a-, a what? A brownie? Was that a-, a did he really say a brownie? <laughs> Why a brownie? I mean, I can understand like a- uh, uh, someone like a green. It's like, uh, or a rookie, but a brownie? Okay. Ah, uh, just gonna just skip all this. Okay. And no cowboy axe. I know that. And one other thing. Yes? Can I call you, can I call you Chris? Why don't you, I was like, <laughs> why Chris? Hang on. Okay, there we go. That's why I need to skip all that, because seriously, I, 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 no one's talking and I'm doing all the voices. It is a little difficult to do with the, uh, with the voices. I get a little bit bored, I'm just talking to myself. And I'm in the middle of talking about Metal Gear... What was it called? Metal Gear Survivor, that's what it's called. Which, like I said, have an open mind about it for now. Because, here's what I'm gonna say. Good game? Because the idea of it is a good game. Just the idea is a good game. But the game itself, because it's in the Metal Gear franchise? No. That's what makes it a bad game. Or, how about this? Good game, bad Metal Gear game. So, I saw the trailer, I saw uh, uh, the aspects of it. It looks like, like I said, it looks like a good game, but not a good Metal Gear game. Because when it comes to Metal Gear Solid... Look, we've had to sacrifice Snake so many times when it comes to, like, Metal Gear Solid... Uh, I'm sorry, Metal Gear Solid 2 and Metal Gear Rising. So, no more sacrificing Snake. No more getting rid of him. We want to play as Snake. Guys, we just heard information about about this game. Just, just the name and like very very few screenshots about it. Now, I'm try to be uh, an optimist when it comes to games like this. So, like I said, try to be an optimist with me. Have an open mind about it and see what you think about it before we actually make a final decision. Be like, oh, this is a bad game. I think it's just because that we have a bad taste with Konami, but with, with uh, yeah, Konami now because of what happened with you know, the team and everything. So. I can understand. We have got a bad taste. All shit is, 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 is happened. And we kind of 
kind of don't want to give them any respect. Which, I'm all for that, I don't want to give them respect as well, nor my money for a game. Okay. Nor, I don't want to give them my money for a game that they basically kind of stole from the legend of Kojima. God damn it! Like I said, I'll keep an open mind about this game because, like I said, it looks like a good game. When it comes to Metal Gear Solid, though, I don't think it's going to be a good Metal Gear game. I think it just came from here, right? No, this is the other one. Okay, so we're, this, this is where we need to go. So, Metal Gear Survivor, guys. Let's keep an open mind about it for now. I know it just came out and we got... And we got no respect for it because of... Kojima, uh, I'm sorry, uh, Konami and everything. I get it. I, but, like I said, it looks like a good game, but not a good Metal Gear game, and hopefully it can improve. So hopefully this game actually takes its time and getting into development, and hopefully Kojima will be like, yeah, fuck you guys. Or hopefully, what everyone was was hoping for is that um, that the game does so bad that it'll, it'll bankrupt uh, Konami, and Konami goes down the drain, and Kojima takes back his Metal Gear franchise and be like, well, Metal Gear Survivor, that could have been a good game, let me make it better, tweak. Oh, the game is so much better, I added a bandana to the guy. Guess what, guys? That's Snake. <laughs> or that was S Snake during the, um, uh, uh, the, 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 the Phantom Pain, uh, franchise. Like, oh, this is what he was actually doing, but nah. That won't, that, that's not gonna happen. I know it's not gonna happen, and it's just, uh, doesn't actually match the timeline, I, I know. But, um, Shit. Like I said, the game actually does look good for an actual game itself, but for a Metal Gear Solid game, no. But we'll see next year when it comes out. So I'm going to end this episode right here, and next time on the non cooperators we will continue with some more Metal Gear Solid Ghost Babble, and hopefully you guys can leave me a like, comment, subscribe. And if you want to talk about some more Metal Gear uh, Metal Gear Survivor, definitely leave a comment below. Criticism or, or or just comments or ideas or anything. Because I actually had ideas about another Metal Gear game, but you're going to have to find out next time in the Cooperators. Where did you come from?